and national investigation are underway following the deaths of seven horses at Churchill Downs ahead of the Kentucky Derby. This is Wave News at 6. I'm Myra Ansari. John is off tonight. While Kentucky racing officials focus on everything that occurred in the state, the National Horse Racing Safety and Integrity Authority will be looking at the horse's histories at tracks across the country. Wave News reporter Mark Stevens says that this whole process is brand new on the national level. The National Horse Racing Safety and Integrity Authority or HISA will get a copy of Kentucky's investigation. It also plans to look at horse fatality rates during the same time period at Churchill Downs a year ago, as well as other historical data. Now, HISA CEO Lisa Lazarus says Kentucky racing officials are focusing on everything that occurred within this state's borders. They're gathering information from people connected to the horses, security personnel, and video. We know from our own open records request to the Horse Racing Commission that state officials sent three emails asking people to preserve relevant evidence related to Safi Joseph Jr. Now those emails were withheld from us because of the pending investigation. State racing officials will then turn over the results of their equine catastrophic injury review to HISA. It's planning to compare the injuries at Churchill against injuries during the same time period a year ago, as well as other relevant time periods. Now, HISA's medication and anti-doping provisions are also set to take effect May 22nd after surviving a legal challenge. The CEO said there is no doubt that the combination of the racetrack safety program and the ADMC program will make our sport safer for the horses entrusted to our care. We don't know how long the investigations will take. The president of the Jockey Club released a statement supporting Heiss's national investigation. Mark Stevens, Wave News.